the plan to be a little more aggressive today or? Yeah, I mean, um, I, th I think I was being a little bit too smart. You know, uh, I went back and kind of just thought about my matches and thought about positions and everything. And I mean, it was more how those first two guys were wrestling me. You know, they were backing up quite a bit and stuff. And that kid just shot off the whistle. So, um, you know, if we get a wrestling match, it, it favors me more times than not, I think. So, um, you know, it's it was my mindset to be more aggressive, but he also brought it too. Bryce, this is, You've done this before. Yeah. What's different this time for you? What, do you feel different? Is the knowledge that you picked up the last couple of years here? Has yeah. that helped you? Yeah, I, I mean, now? I think maturity is always key, you know, and um, um, I've, I've learned how to win the close matches even more than I was my, my sophomore year, you know, so um, that, that's where you, it's really big. I came out here my sophomore year um, with nothing to lose, but I, I still wanted to be a national champ, and I, and I almost got it done, so. Um, the, the goal has not changed. It's always been get on top of that podium. So that, that'll never change. But yeah, of course, I think I've advanced and got better at winning close matches. You're no longer sneaking up. Even last year, you weren't sneaking up on yeah. anybody. And this year, you come in an entirely different perspective. You're the number one seed, and people are, are giving you their best game. I mean, Perry had a rough road to get to you and you know, was ready for you. You shot right off the whistle. I mean, yeah. you, that's what is that the guys you want to wrestle? Those guys that are going to come after you the whole match? Yeah, I mean that's uh that's why we're at the national tournament. You know what I mean? Some people are like, oh, you don't have a seeded guy in the quarterfinals. I'm like, well, if we're going by seeds, then why don't I just get my national title March 10th when the seeds came out? You know? But that's why we're here wrestling. That's what we're doing. We're we're here wrestling matches, and he stepped up and he's he put a show on for for his school those first two matches, and then um, you know I had to end it. My 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 dreams a little bit more important to me. Before the interview started, uh, Jaden Ironman ran by, gave you a hand slap, said good job. Uh, he's sitting in the other semifinals. There's a good chance you guys are going to meet. Uh, talk about the mutual respect there. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, we've always just been pretty friendly and stuff. He, he's, he's a pretty friendly guy, and I am too, so uh, there's a lot of mutual respect there. Uh, we're, we're both chasing that, uh, that championship, and we're on the opposite side, so we can kind of be friendly until, until we get to the finals. So, so it's fun. Um, I always try to stay like that with people. This is... This isn't UFC, this isn't where I'm telling you that F your family and all that kind of stuff. Like, this is wrestling, there's a lot of respect in this and it, it's fun and, um, you know, I, I enjoy everybody I wrestle with. I'm a fan of 141 pounds, regardless if I'm in it or not. Tonight, it's not nice. What's the mentality going in? Uh, How do you like the matchup? It's good, uh, you just gotta wrestle smart against him. Um, he's got a low stance, he kinda, he kinda puts you to sleep and then he blasts off his shots really well and he's, he's really solid in his positioning, so. Um, you just got to be patient with him, and you just got to be ready and focus for seven minutes. He likes scoring at the end of periods and all that kind of stuff, and, and you know he's been on a tear. So it's um it's a good matchup. If there's ever good matchups in the national semifinals, but I, I'm happy for it. This looks like a season where you 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 you've always seemed to be a wrestler that enjoys yourself, but it really seems like this year you've gone out of your way. I mean, taking on Seth Gross, the duel in the high school. I mean, is this an important year for you? I mean, just to have the fun. Yeah, I mean. Uh, I always say I, I'm trying to build a brand for myself, for my school, whatever it may be. Um, I'm trying to leave my legacy on this sport, and I'm trying to be like immortalized because I want people to remember me even 10 years down the road. I want people to remember Bryce Meredith and the wrestler he was. So, um, you know, anytime I can do anything, I, I'm, I'm down for it. It's, it's not about wins and losses during the year. It's all about just having fun and becoming a better wrestler. And I mean, this is my last year doing this. Like, I, I freestyle afterwards, but this is kind of the end of the career for that. And, um, you know, you got you to go out with a bang. You have a huge group that came out from Wyoming to watch you. Yeah. A lot of friends, a lot of relatives. Mm -hmm. What do you got to say to them? Oh, man, they're, they're the greatest. You know, I, they're almost too much sometimes. I'm like, hey, you guys love and support. It's got to chill until Saturday. We'll, we'll celebrate on Saturday because I got over 30 family uh, members here and I got over 10 good friends. So um, there's a lot of people here. There's a, there's a big crowd for uh, Meredith in Wyoming. And, and, I mean, they're the reasons why I'm here. I'll never be here without them, without their support, without their sacrifice. There's a lot of time and money that goes into the sport. It's not it's not just me doing it. So um, not self-made. This is a, I'm a product of all of them. And um, ultimately, it's just all the credit goes to them. How's the head feeling? Uh, it feels good. You know, I, I, I didn't notice it ever. Um, got some stitches up on top of the head for some people I didn't know. Um, I, I think it's fun. I think it just adds to the, to the intensity of this tournament. And like I say, it's madness going for the reader look yeah yeah exactly i want that picture like him after i won a national title flexing with my my head taped because uh, that's a very cool picture great guy um you know hopefully hopefully i can do something like that good luck tonight man thank Thanks, you guys Bryce.